This is such a close angle. Okay, so I'm supposed to be like done or like yes with my makeup by now, but I'm not, so I am stressing. Hey guys, and here's the makeup that I wore to prom. Perfect for all us model litters. I just hope you guys really enjoy this casual video I threw together. So let's get started. I'm starting off with my eyes first because I'm going to be taping them. So right now I'm just priming my lids and under my eye and I'm going to just set it. Now that is the universal hand motion for will be taping my eyes. So after I've taped them, which took forever, I'm going to start my eye makeup. I'm taking these two colors and I'm using them as my transition shade and I'm putting it right in my non-existent crease or more my eye socket, if you will. I'm taking this light color and putting it all over my lids as a base and then I'm going to spray my brush with this mist and fix Woo. so that that rose color can be super pigmented and super bright and I'm just gonna put that all over my lids now I'm picking up my favorite brown this is a gorgeous brown and it has like gold sparkles in it I love it and it's from this Dior palette which is discontinued I'm so sorry um, but I'm just putting that in my outer corner, outer V area, just darkening up the whole eye look. Now I'm taking some black and on a small brush, I'm making an outer wing and I'm making a base for it because I'm going to be using liquid liner, but I do this on my regular everyday makeup looks. I think it's a great trick to darken the makeup look but also help me make that wing a little better. Without any more product, I'm just taking that brush that I used before with the brown and I'm blending more, blending more. Blending is so important, I just keep blending throughout. And I'm also taking that brush with rosé. I'm taking a little bit more rosé because I feel like that it had faded when I was blending. So I'm just adding that back. Taking black again on an angled brush. I think it's an eyebrow brush, but it works perfectly. I did smudge it up into the crease before, so now I'm just making the wing more prominent. Taking that same matte color from before, I'm just highlighting my brow bones. And now I'm going to highlight my inner corners using this shimmery beige. Finally, my personal favorite part, the eyeliner. I always do a wing, so prom was no different. I think a wing really helps my eye shape and just changes my eye look dramatically. So here I am. It was drying out on me, but I pulled through. And when I'm done with the eyeliner, I'm gonna rip off the tape. I don't know, why does it have to be so cold? Oh no. Since there's gonna be no more fallout from the eyes, let's start with the face. This is my base and my primer, and I'm rubbing that all in so my makeup can stay and look great. And I'm eating, of course. Now I'm applying my foundation. I dot it all over my face, and then I take from the bigger dots on my face and I spread it out. Then I use my beauty blender this magical thing to blend it all in. Now I'm using this concealer to highlight. I'm putting it on my cheek area, that little triangle area, my nose, and my forehead, and like my above my cupid's bow and my chin. Now we're on to contouring. I'm putting it on my little contour cheek bony area, my forehead, sides of my nose, and like my jaw. And I feel like this color is a little warm, but I made it work. 
I'm blending it all out with this Artiste brush knockoff. I don't have anything to compare it to because I've never used an Artiste brush. And I got this one from Amazon for like five bucks. And I really like it. I really like it to blend out everything. But then um, I do go in with a beauty blender in the end or just after this to blend in a little bit more. But I do really like this product. Here it's time to set slash bake. I don't really bake that often or that much because I kind of have combination skin, but I do have really dry skin on my cheeks and under my eyes. And so the product will cling and I don't want that. So I don't leave it on for that long and I don't use that much. To set my contour, I'm using the Hoola Bronzer. <laughs> I didn't realize how many weird faces I made until I was editing this video. So... I guess this is how I look like when I'm putting on my makeup. It's brow time now that we're all settled in. I'm using dip brow today. I don't really like to use pomade or dip brow because I just can't really work with it on a daily basis. I can't work with it at this time right now. But it is longer lasting so I do wear it for like special occasions. I'm just doing my brows. Since I've dusted off that bake, I'm now ready for blush. I don't use that much blush because I do get red in the cheeks and red in the face pretty easily. So I let that natural flush come through. I curled my lashes and added mascara. And now I'm putting this nude liner in my waterline to brighten and open them eyes. And now here's a clip of my friend's amazing contour. Look at it! <laughs> She's like, I'll blend it. <laughs> hey, look. Wow. <laughs> You're like, wow, it doesn't look so bad. Ah! I mean, like, okay. Oh, after you cut it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. I'm just gonna go out like this. Oh, no! <laughs> <laughs> she was struggling. But okay, back to the video. I'm just taking light brown on a small brush and putting it in my lower lash line. And I added some false lashes, of course, necessary for my non-existent lashes. And check out this highlight. Oh my god. Look at this. Isn't this amazing? I'm it's dead. so big. It's so big. It's like... No, my head's big. I know this. Yeah, this could last you forever. My friend came in so clutch with this Jeffree Star Skin Frost. Uh, I love it. For lips, I'm going with a dark lip. These are my friend's lip products. I've never done a dark lip before, and this was my first time. It was so scary, but I think it was okay. Uh, later on, I did end up adding Lolita over it by Kat Von D, and it just mattified it. It didn't add any color. I sprayed some mist and fix all over my face and this is my finished prom makeup look. Since I am such a horrible vlogger and whatnot, I really wanted to add some photos of prom. We took pictures at a country club and then we took pictures at 7-Eleven. Iconic. I know. I just wanted to show you my dress and my friend's dresses. And I just wanted to make a shout out to my friends for making this senior prom so great. I'm kind of nostalgic looking back at it. It was like a couple weeks ago right now and it was just so cute. I'm getting sentimental. But yeah, here's some pictures. I hope you guys really enjoyed and I was supposed to vlog the whole night. It never happened, but I just really wanted to share it my makeup with you guys so thank you guys so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next video bye hello oh we're talking yeah follow me on insta okay, <laughs> twitter too